Hello, my name is Pastor David Prang. I'm with Brewster Baptist Church. I'm one of the pastors here. And thank you very much for joining us on the verse of the day. And today's devotion comes from Ruth chapter 2, verses 15 and 16. And it's entitled, Looking Out for the Needy Among Us. In chapter 2, we see a wealthy, influential landowner named Boaz. And Boaz loves God, but he also shows kindness to the people that are in need, especially the poor of his day. And let me read to you chapter 2, verses 15 and 16. It says, As she got up to glean, referring to Ruth, Boaz gave orders to his men, Let her gather among the sheaves, and don't reprimand her. Even pull out some stalks for her from the bundles and leave them for her to pick up, and don't rebuke her. When I see chapter 2, I see how special Boaz is in treating people. See, when Boaz heard the story of Ruth and what, he, and what she'd done for her mother-in-law, Naomi, he's just really, it really strikes him. And he shows, wants to show kindness and love towards Ruth, and even to the point of protecting her. See, back in the day, it was customary for farmers to leave part of their crop unharvested, for people that are poor, people that are needy to come alongside and harvest them, called gleaning. And Boaz, and Boaz instructs his workers to help Ruth in pulling out some of the stalks, and even, by, even for providing protection for her. And I see in this story a generous, influential landowner showing kindness to Ruth. It makes me think about how I need to be generous with what God has given me. See, God has given me money, he's given me possessions for me to enjoy, but he also expects me to be generous with those things as well. And from the story of Boaz and Ruth, we can learn that we need to be generous with the things that God has given us. God wants us to show kindness to people in need. So here's my challenge for you this morning. is simply this, is look around and see how you can just make a difference with one person, how you can show kindness. Pray about it and do it. Show kindness to someone. Be generous with the possessions that God has given you. I hope you are enjoying these videos. Um, if you are, please let Pastor Doug or myself know. Have yourself a great day. Thanks.